Arirang Special. Humanity has entered the 21st century, the urban millennium. We will be seeing another one billion people added uh, to the ranks of existing higher population uh, by 2050. What draws people to cities? What is so special about them? In search of more and better opportunities. Higher living standards. And a brighter future. People are moving to cities this very moment. Are cities really the land of dreams? Can they make wishes come true? The first condition for an ideal city is sustainability. However, there are several obstacles to achieving this. Unfortunately, the rest of Asia, the cities are not in a sustainable path now. And I think all our collective effort is to start making the move towards sustainable solutions. They're not there right now in terms of how they consume energy or how they consume water or how they manage their transport. Uh, the housing for the population, none of them are in a situation in most of the developing countries which is sustainable right now. Urbanization poses several problems. Though predictable, they are never easy to solve. Se genera principalmente porque la estructura urbana de la ciudad en términos de, de vías, por ejemplo, mantiene la misma estructura desde hace 50 años. Entonces, mientras sigue llegando gente a la ciudad, la ciudad mantiene una infraestructura obsoleta. Every country desires to build ideal cities. But the biggest challenge is funding. I think funding is very critical. You just cannot proceed with the, in some municipalities with the existing financial difficulties that they face. So leveraging funding uh, based on a, on a negative balance sheet is going to be very difficult if you are going to go into bigger technologies or a scale in terms of the impact. Poor infrastructure is most prevalent in housing. The problem of so-called slums, created by dense and overcrowded neighborhoods, is threatening the developing world. Congdongcheroso, 모두의 삶의 질을 같이 증진시켜야 되는 이것 간의 균형을 잡아야 되는 게 이제 굉장히 큰 숙제입니다. 다 같이 또잘 사는 것이 가능한 그 균형을 한쪽으로 쏠리는 것이 아니라 그것 간의 균형을 해서 우인윈 솔루션을 찾아가야 되는. Urbanization involves dealing with many intense problems, but at the same time, they create new engines of innovation. Urban growth occurs all around the world. However, it is more rapid in cities of developing countries. Latin America is a prime example. Rapid urbanization has been shaping the continent for the last half century. 
And now, there are five cities with a population of over 10 million. In South America, urbanization is taking place three to four times faster than the average rate of the rest of the world, with a large number of megacities expected to grace the continent soon. However, rapid growth has resulted in various problems for Latin America as well. Therefore, the whole continent strives to solve those issues. What changes and improvements are being made in Latin American cities? Lima is the capital city of Peru, located on the country's arid Pacific coast. Las migraciones entonces en el caso peruano tuvieron siempre como mira Lima están un tercio de la población del país. Somos 10 millones en Lima y somos 30 millones en el país. Lima was a small village during the period of the Incan Empire. But the city now boasts a population of 12 million after rapid migration. The increase in population put tremendous strain on the city's capacity to provide basic services such as energy, education, health care, transportation and sanitation. Among them, lack of affordable housing has been particularly problematic. Eh, nosotros nos ubicamos acá el año 2010 y luego este, tomamos posesión de repente toda la área que usted ve, ¿no? toda la zona geográfica. Eh, el tema de que no podemos estar nosotros de repente en Miraflores, en La Molina, porque somos de bajo recurso económico, ¿no? Y a veces la clase pues baja, estamos acá de repente los, en los cerros, ¿no? Eh, tomamos posesión como invasión para poder ubicarnos y tener pues un techo propio, ¿no? Due to lack of support from the government, living conditions are very poor. However, rural dwellers continue migrating to Lima for one reason. Mis padres son campesinos. Tienen sus ganados. Yo vivía con mi papá, pasteaba sus ganados. Ya. Y también estudié primaria hasta quinto año de primaria ya. Uno por motivo de trabajo. Por motivo de trabajo. <coughs> Porque mayormente hacia, no todo en provincia, ¿no? En algunas provincias no hay mucho trabajo. Simplemente que hay este ganadería, sembré o eso, pero no hay otros empleos, como digamos, ¿no? Entonces vienen con el propósito de mejorar o buscar su trabajo para acá para mejorarse. In hopes of a better life and future, Leda also came to Lima. However, the only job she can find is cleaning, which doesn't pay very well. In my case, I came to study, and apart from that, I don't want to be like my parents, but different. In Peru, all the resources and opportunities are concentrated in Lima, the capital. The central area and new towns are well equipped with social infrastructure. However, the standard of living varies greatly depending on the district even in the same city. Maria and Jorge reside in San Borja it's a new suburb built around the only elevated railway in Lima. Eh, 
el sitio donde estamos nosotros acá, yo estoy muy contenta, me encanta la naturaleza, tenemos cerca el Pentagonito que podemos hacer ejercicio. Bueno, en las zonas residenciales siempre ha habido todo eso, ¿no? Luz, agua. Nonetheless, everyone in the city is aware of the problems. Si ustedes salen un poco de los distritos más este, modernos, van a ver que la gente vive en los cerros y ahí no hay agua, ni tampoco luz. A, a, y estamos en Lima, eso es, eso es lo más crítico. Y si la gente sigue viniendo de provincias, porque en provincias carecen de todos esos servicios básicos. Ese es el gran problema que tiene que afrontar Lima. Each citizen needs at least 30 liters of water per day for health and hygiene. However, there are many areas with no supply of clean water. Clean drinking water is essential for survival, especially in cities. The problem is, it requires money and technology to provide a steady and reliable supply of clean water. Nos ha cortado el agua. No hay, no hay agua. No hay agua. This problem cannot be solved at an individual level. Pero acá realmente no tenemos, uh, solamente tomamos de un manantial o quizás captamos uh, el agua de la lluvia. Estamos solicitando para que nos um, haga un proyecto de, de sistema de agua potable. Tanque de reservoy, punto de captación, el, uh, el, Tal vez nos puede instalar, y mientras no, nosotros no tenemos capacidad por bajo recurso económico. Water covers 70% of our planet, but the usable portion of fresh water on Earth is only 0.01% of all water. Rich water resources do not necessarily equate to drinking water. Therefore, cities and countries are responsible for providing clean drinking water for their citizens. In the world, the people who live in the world are different from the people who live in the world. The most important thing to live in the world is the most important thing to live in the world. So, the water is the water. However, in the world, there are many cities 상수도가 공급조차 되지 않고 있는 지역이 많습니다. 따라서 더 좋은 물을 생산하여 공급하려는 노력도 중요하지만 세계적으로 보면 안전한 수돗물의 공급을 확대해 나가는 것이 더 절실하다고 보겠습니다. One of the solutions to address water scarcity is through international cooperation. Tantamayo is a 10-hour drive from Lima. It's a small city comprised of San Ramon, La Merced, and Pitanaki. Located in an alpine region, the city is beautiful and clean with wonderful scenery. However, this water is not suitable for drinking because the quality is below the legal standards. The United Nations began construction of a water plant in the region, but has since been halted after a major landslide. And the citizens weren't able to restore the plant on their own. Then the plant started to be reconstructed in 2013 with the support of Seoul. All the pipes were replaced with a new water tank and the district finally established a stable water supply for the citizens. La planta que nos habían dejado eh, inconclusa, que ha construido de, de manera parcial, o sea, no funcionando, ¿no? Actualmente ya con el apoyo del gobierno metropolitano de, de Seúl, que agradecemos bastante, que hemos podido nosotros este, complementar y poner en funcionamiento esta planta. With new purification facilities from Seoul, the San Ramon tries to provide high-quality water to the citizens.
What is the quality of the water processed at the San Ramon Water Purification Plant? Ahorita, como como podemos ver y no y que podemos inspeccionar, tenemos una planta de tratamiento ya modificada gracias no al gobierno de no de metropolitano de Seúl. La calidad de agua actualmente en la ciudad de San Ramón es una calidad de agua blanda. Es una buena calidad. La turbidez que te, to, que tomamos en captación es de 0.9. Nueve, ¿no? hasta uno es lo máximo que puede llegar. No hay presencia de carbonato y calcio, no hay presencia de mucha contaminación microbiológica, ni mucho menos contaminación de, de presencia de minerales. Paso, paso. Clean, safe drinking water is crucial in Chanchamayo because bacterial levels are relatively high in natural water due to the local climate. Before the water plant was built, everyone, including the poor, purchased purified drinking water. Sí sabía, sí sabía que Corea nos apoyó con la gestión de agua. También siempre vengo porque el agua es muy necesario en la población y es muy rica. Interesante, muy importante porque lo veo un agua de calidad bien limpia para poder eh, consumir cada uno de nosotros y nuestra familia especialmente. With easy access to clean running water the quality of life for the citizens dramatically improved. The San Ramon Water Purification Plant provides clean water to only the district. Therefore, the second water plant is set to be built in La Merced. Once the second water plant is completed, the third water plant will be built in Pichanaki. Ya, lo que se va a hacer acá es una captación para tomar esta agua de esta quebrada y un desarenador que va en esta parte. Mi sueño la, o la idea que tengo de, de Chanchamayo es que pues se desarrolle en todos los aspectos social, económica y que tenga pues el tema de en el caso del agua que tenga abastecimiento a las 100 personas, el caso de tecnología que contemos con todos lo, los avances que tienen los países desarrollados, ¿no? With the help of Seoul, Chanchamayo has made tremendous strides in ensuring access to safe and clean drinking water for the citizens. Their genuine efforts are helping to make a positive change in Peru. Along with clean water, public transportation is also very important in big cities. The bigger the city, the heavier the traffic. Traffic congestion is a huge task facing any megacity. Bogota is the beating heart of Colombia. It's an engaging and vibrant capital cradled by chilly Andean peaks. Bogota, al ser la capital de Colombia, es una ciudad que ofrece mayores oportunidades de empleo. Es la ciudad con más altos niveles en calidad de vida. Ofrece mejor calidad en servicios dotacionales, aparte de mayor diversidad cultural y en general se convierte en la ciudad más atractiva para vivir por parte de los colombianos que viven en otras ciudades y en las áreas rurales. From intelligent green design to leisure activities, the city offers an array of choices for citizens. It is no surprise why more and more Colombians are moving to the capital. They want to enjoy the benefits and convenience the city provides. El crecimiento poblacional de Bogotá se ha vuelto un tema exponencial principalmente sobre la segunda mitad del siglo XX. La ciudad anualmente crece más o menos unos 100.000 habitantes por año. 
when a city grows, citizens inevitably travel further into the city. Increased population means an increased demand for transportation. Bogota's population nearly hit the 10 million mark. However, the city offers only trains, taxis, and three types of buses. Indeed, congestion is extremely problematic. The city has tried various systems to ease the traffic, including the construction of bus rapid transit system, which has been benchmarked by Seoul and many other cities. However, the city's traffic reached unbearable levels, and Bogota had to adopt a new system. The best option for them at the time was developing the existing traffic systems. Un transporte público que contaminaba, que había sobre oferta del parque automotor, igualmente que generaba altos niveles de accidentalidad. La remuneración del conductor era por usuario. El mismo conductor era el que recaudaba los recursos. Y en ese sentido, pues digamos que los índices de accidentalidad eran bastante altos. Igualmente, pues habían eh, desplazamientos muy largos, toda vez que ese sobre, sobre oferta en el parque automotor hacía que los desplazamientos de los ciudadanos en Bogotá de un sitio a otro tomara eh, muchísimo tiempo. Y por supuesto eso iba en contravía de lo que realmente buscaba el gobierno desde entonces como una política de Estado de mejorar la calidad de vida de todos los habitantes de Bogotá. The city first focused on rapid bus transit services. Transmillennio is the quickest means of transport in Bogota. Operating all around the city, the buses transport some 2 million passengers every day. Transmillennio is a system troncoalimentado. ¿Qué significa troncoalimentado? Hay unas troncales que son las, las vías de mayor capacidad, de alta capacidad, por la cual se desplazan buses articulados y biarticulados. So, los buses articulados tienen una capacidad de 160 pasajeros. Los buses biarticulados tienen capacidad de 240 pasajeros cada bus. Passengers pay their fares with bus cards. When there are too many passengers, they close the station until more can be accommodated. Al implementarse Transmilenio, se redujeron los índices de accidentalidad, se redujo la, la sobreoferta, pues porque ya había un parque automotor racional, hubo mejor uso de los recursos, pues se operaba sobre carriles exclusivos, esto aumentó la capacidad, la eficiencia del sistema de transporte público. Second was the unified management of public transportation. This is the central command center that monitors traffic incidents with teams of technicians specializing in various related fields. Desde este centro de operaciones se controla toda la flota que, que opera en el sistema. Básicamente el, el sistema se basa en una, en una programación que define qué rutina debe hacer a lo largo del día cada operador o, o conductor de, de cada uno de los buses realizar durante el día. Este centro de control también es el encargado de aplicar todas las acciones de regulación o medidas que se requieren para poder llegar a atender contingencias dentro del sistema. They quickly and systematically deal with all emergency situations on the road, including traffic accidents and protests. Along with many other situations that could occur while operating buses. Hay usuarios que de pronto subiendo a un bus se caen o son golpeados por otros usuarios que están ingresando al bus. 
y eso lleva a que de pronto tengan lesiones. Nosotros en, de, en Transmilenio ten, adoptamos un protocolo para la atención de ese tipo de contingencias. Cuando el usuario es afectado por algún tipo de retraso, desde este centro de control se monitorea a través de cámaras cómo es el comportamiento de la flota y se ubican puntos críticos en los cuales es necesario el despacho de buses adicionales o regulados para enviarlos a esos, a esos sitios y poderlos eh, evacuar o eh, cargar a todos los usuarios. The system was the result of thorough research into public transportation systems in other countries to improve domestic services. Third was the introduction of Seoul's traffic control system. In 2011, Bogota announced a big plan for the city, reformation of the public transportation system. It was a huge project with many companies taking part in the bidding process. Due to the high interest from the public, the selection process was aired live on TV. And the city's choice was the Korean company LG CNS. We were in 2004 to build the Seoul system. It was a great solution for the city of Seoul and the city of Seoul. We looked at the city of Seoul and the city of Seoul. We looked at the city of Seoul and the city of Seoul. We didn't know the city of Seoul and the city of Seoul. This new project installed a smart card ticketing system on buses, as well as control systems at 151 bus stops. As a result, all the issues related to the buses can now be handled at the main control tower. Modernizar y implementar ciertos requisitos para, pues, para ofrecer el servicio de transporte público urbano en la capital. O sea, creo que ese es el sentido de implementar y sistematizar el servicio, dándole un, un toque como moderno, un toque especial, por decirlo así. Using integrated payment systems, these buses offer free transfers with zonal buses as well. 택시처럼 그냥 교차로 에서도 사람이 손을 들고 쓰면 막 서요. 막 급발진하고 문 열고서 막 다니고 뭐 이런 열들이 많이 있었는데 우리 시스템이 들어가 가지고 그걸 시스템적으로 다 막아 놨어요. 예를 들면 교차로 에서 쓰면 자동적으로 데이터가 이 운전사가 불법을 저질렀다라고 해 가지고 시스템적으로 알러지 떠요. 그걸 시에서 그거를 그 정도 가지고 패널티를 시스템적으로 막여 버려요. 근데 처음에는 의심이 있던 사람들이 자꾸 시스템에서 페널티를 맞으니까 지금은 자기 스스로가 준법하는 그런 문화 그러니까 만 이천 대가 준법을 하고 그 다음에 트렁크 버스와 조널 버스 일반 버스들이 서로 통합 환승하고 그래서 시민들은 또 요금을 덜 내고 또 빨라지고 하니까 상당히 그 만족해하는 그런 상황이죠. Some five million citizens of Bogota benefit from this new ticketing system every day with smart card usage increasing threefold since launching. So what has been the response of the public? Bueno, al principio fue difícil porque la, no todo el mundo tenía la tarjeta. Entonces, pues, tocaba ir, comprarla, localizar los puntos donde eh, se recargaba la tarjeta o bien sea, se compraba. Y ya, pues, a medida del tiempo, las estaciones se fueron también eh, adaptando y la, la gente también, entonces ya es muy común uno obtener la tarjeta tuya. The traffic system has improved as a whole, but there is still a long way to go. Eh, los horarios en los que salen los buses a veces no son como a concuerdo, o sea, acuerdo a todas las necesidades de los pasajeros. Y también las rutas están como mal planeadas, entonces genera pues tráfico y caos en la ciudad. A veces tienes que esperar mucho para un bus y cuando llega está lleno, entonces tienes que salir con muchísimo más tiempo de antelación de tu casa para lograr llegar a tiempo a las reuniones o al trabajo. La gente todavía no entiende el servicio, entonces la gente todavía busca las busetas normales. De pronto en eso ha cambiado, pero es la misma congestión, el mismo tráfico, la misma, pues 
de pronto ahorita se ve un poquito más organizado, pero me parece que es lo mismo. Bueno, realmente sí ha mejorado, pero el nivel de población ha aumentado, es decir que el progreso no es muy bueno. Pero sí, si sí hay una evolución. Obviously, it was impossible to solve all those issues with just buses. But it was a good first step that also reduced the city's CO2 emissions by 750 million tons. Now the city is gearing up for another reformation. Digamos que hoy Bogotá viene adelantando diferentes estrategias con el ánimo de poder mejorar la prestación del servicio, poder distribuir mejor sus rutas en todas las en todas las eh, líneas eh, que se tienen establecidas en la ciudad de Bogotá. Adicionalmente, se están extendiendo rutas, mayor ampliación, mayor cobertura y, por supuesto, también la construcción de sistemas intermodales. Por ejemplo, la construcción de cables aéreos que estén alimentando directamente a Transmilenio y la futura construcción del metro de Bogotá, que va a ser una línea que, por supuesto, va a estar incorporada dentro del sistema integrado de transporte público de, de la capital del país. In 2006, the city announced its Mobility Master Plan, which was to encourage pedestrian use in the city. The city then underwent a second reformation with a new bus system, and now the third big change is on its way. Creo que en la medida en que el ciudadano no tenga que utilizar transporte individual, carro particular, y podamos incentivar el transporte colectivo el transporte a través de sistemas con el ánimo de poder lógicamente mejorar los tiempos de desplazamiento, mejorar las condiciones de, de operación de los mismos sistemas y por supuesto tener unos sistemas mucho más amigables con el medio ambiente y con el ciudadano. In this globalized era, changes are taking place with cooperation between countries. With the help of developed countries, Latin American cities persistently seek ways to solve the problems they have. One of the solutions was the smart city strategy. Smart cities are a type of future city in which everything is connected. Intelligent and green. From office buildings to homes, cars, public transportation, infrastructure, and communication. It's all about transforming cities to enhance the quality of life for citizens and for sustainable urbanization. Smart city, uh, in a simple way, it's a good city. It's a good city, 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 도시민의 삶, 그 다음에 도시에서 뭔가 이제 경제적인 행위를 하는 비즈니스를 하는 사람들에서 편리성과 효율성 이런 것들이 이제 증진된 그래서 생산성이 높아지고 삶의 질이 높아진 살기 좋은 그런 도시로 전환된 그게 이제 자, 스마트 도시의 핵심입니다. These days, many nations plan to build smart cities to expand their technical boundaries. What is the vision for developing countries regarding their ideal smart cities? Seoul is a prime example of rapid urbanization in the developing world. Within half a century, South Korea experienced an unprecedented increase in the rate of urbanization since the end of the Korean War. Now, Seoul's upgrade to a smart city is imminent. Seoul is not only our own, but also in the world, in a short time, 도시 개발의 성공적인 사례 도시로 많이 소개되고 있습니다. 한 30년간의 그 짧은 역사에 많은 성과를 냈고 이것이 다른 남미라든지 동아시아라든지 개발 도상 국가의 그 도시들 지금 막 발전하고 변화하려고 하는 도시들에게 희망이나 비전을 할수 있다는 가능성을 준다는 것이 저는 제일 큰 도움이라고 봅니다. Let's take a glimpse into the lives of a couple residing in Korea. 저희는 서울에 거주하는 결혼 3년차 부부입니다. The couple commutes using public transportation every day. That's one of the big advantages of living in Seoul. 
People can go anywhere using public transportation. Also, there are many smartphone apps offering public transport information that allow people to find the quickest routes for their journey. Sangam Digital Media City used to be a big island of trash named Nanjido. However, now it is an outstanding model of a green smart city where cutting edge technology, nature, and residential areas coalesce. 제가 근무하는 빅데이터 센터입니다. 공공과 민간 데이터를 분석해 도시 문제 해결 솔루션을 만들어내는 일을 하고 있습니다. All data gathered in the city is shared with the public. An environment-friendly transportation is gradually expanding. 시간제로 빌릴 수 있는 공유 자전거예요. 걷기엔 멀고 차 타기엔 애매한 거리를 이용할 때 딱이에요. With eco-friendly transportation, the city hopes to reduce CO2 emissions even if it is just a small degree. In Bukchon, citizens are provided with Internet of Things. The local government offers an array of smart services, ranging from safety, emergency management, and maps, both for locals and visitors via Internet of Things. 이렇게 내 위치를 중심으로 필요한 코스를 파악해서 다니면 간단하죠. 사물 인터넷 서비스 덕분에 옛날처럼 흠미지 않아서 좋습니다. As the world's most wired city, free Wi-Fi is available in most areas in Seoul, allowing people to make full use of the services provided. Also, People can be connected wherever they are in the city using the free Wi-Fi services. For the environment, all the waste is sorted for reuse. Seoul offers another kind of eco-friendly transportation for the sharing economy. It's car sharing services. Citizens can rent shared cars for the hours reserved and then return it to a location more convenient for them. The result has been a rethink of car ownership. Are they happy about their lives in Seoul? Indeed. Seoul is not the only model for how to manage rapid urbanization. There is no one-size-fits-all solution to the issue. Nonetheless, through trial and error, Seoul is definitely a great example for all developing countries to benchmark. When the city is developed, people are going to come to the city. 그게 없을 때 이제 슬럼 문제부터 해서 환경 문제 같은 것들이 많이 커질 텐데 문제는 이제 그거를 아직 가보지 않은 미래라는 거죠. 저희는 이제 지나왔기 때문에 과거를 볼수 있지만 저희가 미래를 알수 있다는 거 굉장히 어려움이 있습니다. 그래서 그거를 이해를 해야 그걸 바탕으로 아 우리가 뭔가 이제 도시 계획을 또는 이제 도시를 잘 만드는 거에 좀더 노력을 해야 되는데 그런 부분에 대한 이해를 높이기 위해서는 협력이라는 것 이전에 일정 정도의 상호 이해하는 과정들을 좀더 많이 가져야 된다라는 거를 좀 개인적으로 느끼고 있습니다. The rapid urbanization and development of Seoul is largely attributed to the genuine help and support from other countries. 
Therefore, the city is fully aware of the importance of cooperation and sharing of knowledge. I'm very, very impressed with uh, what has been done uh, by Seoul in the last 10 to 15 years. Uh, 15 years ago, I came to Seoul. I think there was a lot of traffic congestion. Uh, it was very difficult to move around. I think today is a much more uh, uh, better city in terms of mobility. You know, it's a beautiful city with uh, projects like Jonggae Stream. And so that's why we are working closely with the Seoul government. We have a collaboration with the Seoul Institute to share and exchange knowledge. The visitors are particularly interested in Seoul's water purifying system. And they're pleasantly surprised by Seoul's cutting edge systems utilizing information technology. They also pay close attention to how Seoul treats and maintains water quality, which is essential for providing high quality tap water. Everyone here is eager to learn more from each other. Asia Zhenghui 呃，一起来找出解决这些问题的途径。From research to production and supply, they observe the entire process. For the sake of their cities, they observe intently. Sometimes, researchers stay in Seoul for a longer period of time. Here, people study how to develop, construct, and run cities in a more effective and efficient way. The majority of the students are civil servants from developing countries. Daniel from Poland works for the government's waste management sector. He strives to master the advanced technology Seoul implements. One is increasing supply, right? Well, the first is uh, like my uh, job about waste uh, system and also about uh, um, administration and finance and uh, transportation and infrastructure. So that's like three uh, major uh, subjects that I would like to um, focus on. I was thinking about the system with bags that you pay for this, what you produce, not that you declare how much you will produce because actually you don't know exactly every month how much waste you will produce. So I think the, the, the idea to the buy uh, uh, what 
the right size bag for you is is good idea, and also about uh, food waste that uh, could be uh, used for uh, compost uh, 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 treatment plant or, or some other ways that uh, they are using to produce uh, biogas. So that I think this is the major uh, idea about the uh, focus about the system of bags and uh, food waste. These people came to Seoul to improve their countries and provide better services for their people. With all the information and experience acquired, they will be equipped to help transform their cities. The sustainable development of cities is one of the main concerns for the world. But the path to achieving that feat remains a work in progress. With that shared goal, the world is coming together, hoping for a better future for all. So sustainable development is an international framework which is agreed to by all the countries in the, of the UN. This is the first time that every country has come together and said these goals are for each country and for all of us. So the first thing is, this is about all of us together. So we have to share these resources and share them so that the poorest people, the most vulnerable people, get the best opportunities. And when we're able to do that and bring this together, I think we can make these things happen. Uh, you know, this is not so complicated to do. What will cities be like in the future? Green space, like parks and some kind of green area for people that they can use and uh, take a rest uh, during the daytime. Where everyone can travel easily, uh, less of pollution, and in, you can in, have efficient mode of transportation or efficient way of uh, reaching to different places. So you can enjoy every facilities in the city. First, I think it should be a safe city. De todas maneras, nosotros queremos ser, buscamos un bienestar, un desarrollo para el bien del pueblo, para el bien de nuestros hijos, y así sucesivamente buscamos un, un, un futuro para los niños. El modelo ideal de la ciudad debe acoplarse precisamente a las expectativas que tienen sus propios habitantes. Ahora bien, siempre hay unos parámetros mínimos de calidad de vida y de sostenibilidad de las ciudades que están asociadas a que las ciudades tengan la capacidad de ofrecerles a, los, a sus ciudadanos los servicios básicos. 앞으로의 도시는 어찌 보면 자연하고 도시라고 했던 우리의 이분법적으로 생각했던 것이 좀더 완화돼서 이 자연 속의 도시이자 도시 속의 자연이 구현되는 그러면서 오히려 더 사람들이 이제 걷거나 가깝게 활동하거나 하는 것들이 가능한 새로운 형태의 도시 형태로 바뀌지 않을까 기대하고 있습니다. People have different expectations and hopes for the cities. But in fact, their wishes are essentially the same. They all hope for better life and future. People shape cities. But cities also shape people to transform growing urban areas into smarter cities, a coterie consisting of governments, industries, academia, and civil societies will pave the way for the realization of this dream.